What's happening guys and welcome to this new series on DGL Puzzle Showcases. In this series, I'll be taking a look at some of my favorite and some of the coolest puzzles I have seen. Yeah, I'm pretty excited. This is a series that I've wanted to do for a little while now. But as some people know, my <laughs> video uploading schedule has kind of gotten a little shaken by unfortunate events. But I'm starting to get back into it, which is good. Um, a little background on me. I actually compete in uh, puzzle competitions. Um, some people from my local chess club go to a coffee shop, actually. And we bring our own puzzles that we found and try to challenge one another to be able to solve them. And I've always enjoyed that. But over the last couple months, I've seen some really, I mean, some of the most mind-boggling and cool puzzles that I, I mean, it's just amazing. Anyway, enough of that. Let's get on. First puzzle right here. It is white to play. Clearly white is up a queen. We can see that. Black is threatening to promote. It's very simple. So, how does white play? Um... Can white win this? I mean, it'd be pretty, uh, pretty lame if you couldn't, right? Up a queen? Well, in fact, white can play to win. So, I'm going to make a random move and go back. So, how can white win? Let's take a look at this. As I've said, black is starting to promote. So let's take a look at some moves. Let's first consider queen c2 which is not the winning move, believe it or not. And I will explain why. Obviously the black king can only go to the corner. And now black is starting to promote this pawn. And how does white actually stop that? <clears throat> well, let's say white, the white queen goes up, and then the king goes over, and we're at the starting position of the puzzle. I'll go back a little. Check. All we did is repeat the position. White has made no progress. So let's go back. After Check. queen c2, king in the corner. What can white do? Every other move allows the black pawn to promote. There is a clever uh, way for white to draw this position, if you can believe that. With um, <clears throat> amazing move, queen Check. c1 check. And now, well, if the... Pawn Check. takes the queen. Stalemate. Is stalemate. So that's a nice draw. There's also a uh, promotion. But what does white do? If the white queen moves to any of these squares, the white, the black queen can just give a check. And not a whole lot is, um, and black is probably going to win. Right? The queen bumps up with check, you know, etc, etc. So, after promoting, the queen can't go up, or to a3 for that matter. Um, another option could be going to e2, or or not e2, excuse me, d1 or e1. Let's say the queen goes to e1. Well, the queen just yeah. takes, king moves, and then promotes. So, that leaves only king move and some pawn moves. And now any pawn move, the Check. queen takes, the white, should, white should recapture, and once again it's stalemate. So believe it or not, <laughs> after queen b1, or actually, after this Check. queen c1 check, it appears to be a draw. But hold on, isn't white playing for a win here? In fact, he is. So if queen c2, let me return to the original position. So if queen c2 wasn't working, what what does white do? What is the winning line? Is white winning? Well, in, ma in a matter of fact, white is winning. And to be more direct about it, it is actually forced mate in 11 moves. And I know what you're thinking. Whoa, whoa, whoa. DGL, man, I don't want to solve some 11 move problem. And I'll be honest, neither do I, but <laughs> I don't like... Um, 
a little off topic. I don't like uh, super long puzzles. You know, as some of my friends know, I'm more of a short and sweet, quick kill type person. But this puzzle was too cool to pass up because if you've never seen it before, it's one that um, it's very neat and was, I think, definitely worth showing. So, <clears throat> here, so um, back to the video or back to back on track, I should say. So, if Queen C2 isn't working, what does White do to win? Um, I'm going to go over the answer now shortly, but first I'm going to give you the first move. Check. Which is Queen D3 check, which is the first move in the winning line. Now, think about it. Why, why would going to the Queen here with check be different than going Queen C2 check? Why, we, sh we see why Queen C2 didn't work really. And queen d3 is the winning line. So think about that for a second. And I'll give you a couple seconds to look at this position. Here, let me go back. Check. After queen d3 check, which is the first move of the winning line. So take a minute, look at the board a little bit, and try to figure out how white can win this position. I'll give you a couple seconds. <clears throat> okay. Friend arrived. And I have a friend that's arrived. Isn't that great? Anyway. So, Queen D3 check. So, obviously, the Black King only has... Um to move to the corner square. Obviously that's the only move, right? <laughs> and now, once again, the black pawn is threatening to promote. <clears throat> so, how does white stop this? As we remember from queen c2, the only way to stop the pawn from promoting was to pin it on c3. Keep in mind the queen was on c2 here. But, as we know, queen is on d3 now. So there's another option with queen d4, which is in fact the next move in our solution. Now, what does black do? This pawn can't move. This pawn can't move. Keep in mind the pin. So that just leaves a king move to the corner. And now, check. white gives a check. Okay. Obviously, the king can't go to any of these squares, so it has to go in the corner. And now, black again, threatening to promote. How does he solve this? I mean, how does white solve this, I mean? He plays queen e5, pinning the pawn once again. And once again, the pawn cannot move, and this pawn is pinned. So the only move is to move the king again. Have you figured out the problem yet? Check. White gives a check. The king has to go in the corner. You pin again. The king has to go back. Check. Check. Are you noticing a pattern yet? King goes in the corner. Queen g7. King only one move. Check. To check once more. King has to go in the corner, and very important, the queen cannot immediately give the check because black once again is threatening to promote. If white gave the check immediately, b1 equals queen would be a sad story to tell. White would not be able to win there. However, you pin one more time with queen h8, once again forcing the king to move. There's no, no other move. And checkmate. the knockout blow, queen h1, checkmate. Wow. So that has been the first puzzle that I will be showcasing in this series. I think it's a pretty cool one if you've never seen it before. You know. Check. 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 Checkmate. Very nice. So yeah.
kind of humorous, the journey that the queen has taken using the pin and the only squares the king can go to to the advantage. Black never got a chance to promote, so White was able to win. Now, when I was in um, a coffee shop and a friend originally showed me this puzzle, and by the way, I was stumped. I mean, I, it took me a good 20 minutes to figure this one out, so it's, don't feel bad if you didn't get it, because <laughs> it took me a little while. Um, when I was looking at it at the coffee shop, I noticed... Here, let me make a random move to get rid of those marks. I noticed that White has three pawns here, right? But why isn't there an H pawn? And, you know, it might not seem like something significant, but when my friend was putting the pieces on the board and telling me to solve the problem, he could have placed pawns anywhere, you know. But I noticed that there wasn't an H pawn, and it made me think, wouldn't it be great to have a queen here? A queen anywhere on this rank, in fact. If you put a queen anywhere here, it's mate. It's kind of a, that was my logic behind it. Anyway, I should keep this video short and sweet. Thanks for checking it out, guys. I hope you enjoyed the puzzle. Um, yeah, until next time, right? I'm going to have some more stuff uploading. Hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys around. Thanks, and bye.